Welcome to a London vlog. Monday morning blues. Do you like your new coat? And I'm greeted by a cute little smile. The world is new. I wanted to properly end this video talking about what I got from Prada, the most sensational PR gift I got from Prada. Welcome to a London vlog. You're going to spend the day with us. So it is the most rainy day, but it's London. Uh, we just been for lunch and we're going to i'll show you what i can see so we're just at the back of bond street not very interesting but we are going to have a little shopping trip on new bond street and we're going to start off with tiffany i have my eye on something two things actually i want to go and have a look at so i'm going to take you with me and i'm loving my outfit today it's so comfy so elegant let me show you i have Mini Kelly, these cream boots. I'm walking in the wrong direction, as not as per usual. But I've had these boots for ages. They've just got the tiniest kitten heel. I'll show you my look properly in a second. But I'm so comfy in this knitted dress. Just an all cream look. And I've got my red Kelly because I didn't want to leave it in the car. So we're just at the top of New Bond Street. I'm gonna start right at the top where Tiffany is. And then we're gonna make our way all the way down to the end. My outfit. Ignore this bag. Actually, this bag does look nice. That's my outfit. Let's go to love this color here tiffany does like a private appointment you can come look around have a nice tea coffee it's really elegant like a more peaceful shopping experience so they're going to bring me the two pieces that i've got my eye on i've had a little look downstairs um i love them both so much that i think i'm gonna get one today and maybe someone for a push present push present me for me, obviously, oh. I'm pushing the baby out. They do men stuff for me? It always has to make it about him. So what did you like more? You think the necklace or one of the cuffs? Well, I've seen the pearl necklace, yeah. Okay, he's given it away that it's a pearl necklace. Yeah. <laughs> but um, I just love the Tiffany pearls. And I think if I'm going to have a Tiffany, if I'm going to have a pearl necklace, I think Tiffany's so special and I can wear it every day no matter what necklace I have it's nice on its own pearls are really good for the day my nan always used to tell me that so we're going to decide now for me jewelry is so nice for milestone moments so with the baby when I achieve something at work something that you can wear every day so these are the pieces that I wanted to show you this is from the knot collection and I love the rose I think they're so delicate but also have like a masculine a masculine touch and these I'm obsessed with these are the bone cuffs and there's one for the right and one for the left and I quite like having the big one with the small one this is what I got made my decision it's so nice shopping up here it's just really peaceful you can think straight um, I'm gonna show you what it is so this room is next to where I just was got the Tiffany lock this is one of my absolute favorites you would have seen me wear this one in the silver 
These are all the iconic pieces and I absolutely love this view as well. Look at that, it's absolutely iconic. So if you come to Tiffany, I definitely recommend you come to the first floor. Who remembers the coffee bean? I got the coffee bean necklace when I was 18, I still have it. I just want this whole collection of bone cuff. I want every single colour. I love this, look at this. It's one of my first Tiffany pieces I ever had. Very happy girl. So we were in there so much longer than I thought, but it's such a nice shopping experience when you can be upstairs, have a nice drink, look at everything. Um, so we've not got too much time to go anywhere else, but I'm happy. I've come, come, out, come for what I intended. Um, to be honest, I don't think there's anything else I want to what to do today. I think we'll get a nice matcha. We're going to pick up Honoré. So we'll probably go for like a nice coffee and hot chocolate together. But what an amazing way to finish my long week. Oh, that's better. I felt like I couldn't breathe. I have a lot of my obstetrician said it's progesterone and nothing to panic about. But I literally do nothing and can't breathe and I'm vlogging and walking and talking so that probably wasn't the clearest for you. But better now I'm sitting in the car. Um, that was really fun, wasn't it? Yes. You love jewellery, don't you? You're the one who got me into jewellery, so you can't blame me. What piece did you like the best? I loved the pearl uh, necklace more than Ethel. Yeah, so... You've already seen that by now, but... I, you all know, I don't have to tell you, I love pearls and I've always wanted a nice pearl necklace, but I wanted something iconic. I keep for it forever. And I never really knew which one to get and I knew that I wanted to invest some money in a nice one and as soon as I saw the Tiffany one I knew that's the one I wanted and then you know later on I can get the matching earrings and kind of add to that collection and when I tried it on it was just beautiful like even you saw with this knitwear just wearing it every day I just think that pearls they're a classic everybody loves pearls but I just think that everyone should wear pearls but that's me and I loved it and I'm obsessed with the bone collection. Those bone cuffs, they're so me, like with my boyfriend jeans, like knit, oversized knitwear that's like pulled up on your shoulders with those two cuffs. You can wear them in the evening with dresses. I think they're beautiful in all three tones of gold. Did you like the cuff? Yes. Um, or the knot one? I like the cuff. One above your belly, one under your belly, uh -huh. <laughs> no, but I liked, I initially when I saw them online, I thought I'd get two big ones, but I really liked the different sizes. I think the small one is first on my list, and then the big one, and you can wear them together or separate, but yeah, it's so miserable. I feel like I had a really nice time in Tiffany. We spent over an hour there, like it's so nice upstairs. Definitely go and book an appointment for upstairs. Uh, but now we're going to get Andre. And, um, I guess show you what we do locally when we pick up on our way from school and go to all our favourite coffee shops in South Ken. Do you like your new coat? Yeah. Is it the same as... Who's got the same as you? Mummy. Mummy, look. We matching? Yeah. Come on then, should we go to get some sweeties? Yeah. Okay. Black ones. Black ones? Do you mean chocolate? I want to brown and... <laughs> Okay, do you not think we should leave that ball at home? We've arrived at Harrods. I promised on the way I'd get him some sweeties because he's been with him, Harris's parents. And he's been such a good boy, so I said I'd take him to like the food hall in Harrods because he loves it. Like all the chocolate areas and let him pick his own chocolates. And um, he loves the chocolate covered strawberries, so we'll get some of them, you know, the Godiva ones. And it's rainy and cold, whereas in Harrods we can be inside and I'll get a couple of food bits as well. Oh, I changed my outfit by the way. So I had this dress in cream. It's the same one. Um, but I thought like spend, I might go to the park with Honoré so I thought I'd better put the grey one on. And then it got colder. And look who's got the same coat as me. He looks so cute. So the Rue Sloan baby coats came in in all colours. Look how cute he looks. Wow. Do you like your new coat? Mm. Who have you got the same coat as? Um, Daddy. And? Look at mine. Mummy. And Daddy. And Daddy's got same. 
Shall should we go? Where are we going, Honore? Where are we going? Let's go. On my hat. <laughs> And he got these new trainers and he asked me to wear them every day. So we normally do this like after school. We normally go to the park. It's a bit rainy today. And we normally go for a coffee, hot chocolate. Um, and then we're going to go for a Japanese for dinner tonight because it's Friday and I don't want to cook. So this is what I changed into. I just put loafers on, socks, and it's the exact same dress. I'll link it below this is too big to be wearing trousers anymore so the Prada cafe um, we've been here before it's on my TikTok actually if you're allergic to nuts you can't have any of their cakes there but it is it is really nice inside I definitely recommend going it's more of an experience than amazing coffee but it is nice I want to sit down in my own environment and like really talk about what I got and show you without like me being so shy because it does feel, it does still, and the only way I can describe it is imposter syndrome, like working with these iconic brands that I love so much and pieces that I just love and yeah, I just wanted to sit in my own environment and when I saw this box, I didn't realise it was going to come in such a beautiful, beautiful box, like look at the leather turquoise box i was like I'm, I'm hormonal i was a bit overwhelmed when i opened it before but look at this box like how beautiful is that how beautiful is this box how amazing this is like what you see it like i mean you've already seen it a hundred times but look at that that's like what you see like celebrities wearing in a box like this so as i, I think i told you i really wanted a set of pearls Pearls are pieces that you can wear. It's going to look so nice with this dress as well. They're pieces that you can wear all day in the day. And I just love how special they are. That it's just got that little Tiffany logo here. Can you see that? Um, it's so tiny. And I always knew that if I had a string of pearls, I really wanted them to be a special a special string of pearls, like something I can pass down, keep forever. I like that it, I, the choker size, because this comes in three sizes, but I like the choker size for two reasons. One, I feel like it's a really modern take on pearls, but also this is, I, I have a lot of necklaces that I love. I have a lot of sentimental necklaces, and I feel like I can wear this as a choker and the other pieces to be slightly longer. And you can just wear it every day, and I think they're so classic. I just think it's so beautiful and if you're going to have pearls like Tiffany is like the one isn't it and it's a beautiful everyday piece that I'm just going to wear all the time but then you can wear them in the evening I just think Tiffany pearls are so so special and I said to Paris that when he wants to surprise me for birthday or Valentine's or something anniversary then there's the matching earrings there's the matching bracelets I love how you continue a set on so I wanted to show you that I then couldn't stop thinking about the cuff, the bone cuff. I love every hardware. I literally want every size, every hardware. And it, you know me, I'll probably end up getting them over the coming years. I ended up ordering the bone cuff. It's not here now, but it's going to be here tomorrow. So I'll insert a cutaway of me wearing it on the shoe and I'll insert the cutaway of when it arrives tomorrow. It was so hard for me to decide what, because you can have them on left and right and you have to wear them on that side. 
So I ended up going for the right side, which normally I prefer the left, but my reason from that, which might help you decide if you want the bone cuff, is I love my still Rolex, and I do wear it every day, not when I'm in London. And the small size cuff, I feel like it's really good for every day. Like I would just wear it with this, you know I'm a knitwear girl, you know I'm a jeans and t-shirt girl. I just love that modern take on fine jewellery to have a nice chunky cuff. I don't have anything like that and I've always been obsessed with cuffs but having a good quality fine jewellery one from Tiffany, I'm just obsessed with it. So it's the size that I would wear every single day. I wear my watch every day, so just wearing those two together, I thought, yeah, that's the one. I'll get the right, so I wear my watch on the left. And my next wish list for, for Tiffany is definitely the left cuff, but I think I'm gonna go for the bigger one. Because when I go out in the evening, I don't tend to wear that big, that big masculine Rolex. So I'd like to wear the two sizes, the big one just as a statement on its own. I even think the big one looks good with the knitwear, so I did order that in the end and I just can't wait to get it. You're gonna see me wearing it every day. I really recommend this, this cuff and I, I went to try it on in Harrods afterwards and they, they said this always sells out, they never have it. So I went back the next day, tried them on and that's when I decided which one I was going to get. So if you're gonna buy anything at Tiffany's, the bone cuff collection in any hardware, whatever, whatever hardware you like. And um, the pearls I think are so special. And although it's classic, I just think it's something that not everybody's going to, but I just think the stream of pearls is the most beautiful choice. So I will link them below as well. Before I go, I wanted to show you, oh this is heavy, the most sensational PR gift I got from Prada. Why am I so weak? Um, I'll save this one to last, but I couldn't believe how massive it was. So first of all, I got this, which is the eyeshadows. And what I love about this is that there's refills with everything. So really beautiful eyeshadow palette with two refills. Everything comes with refills. That in itself I loved. I was like, wow, that's amazing. Then there was this box. It came in the most gigantic Prada box as well. Um, this was all beautifully displayed, but they're lipsticks. There's a lip balm. It's so good, and it's like this minty colour. I'll link them below. And then there's one colour that I absolutely loved. You have to get it. I will link it below, but it's like the most beautiful rose colour. Really, like, nourishing but matte. Again, come with refills. So at this point, I was like, wow, thank you so much. I just kept on going. Oh, no, that's the, like, amazing one that I gasped and squilled. All the skin prep really here, I'll link them below. I've, I've tried everything here, like just vaguely. This is a really good winter colour for me. The, the texture of the foundation looks really nice, but I'm going to need the darker shade for summer. But right now it's actually a really good shade. This was the one that I was just so excited about. Prada Tools, and I'm thinking, is this what I think it is? Yes, it was. Wow, how? amazing is this i really am a fan of makeup brushes and this just has everything this is going to be so good for under the eye such a beautiful blusher brush and i like my favorite are eyeshadow brush I, i'm an eyeshadow girl look at all that like the eyeliner one all the different oh this is just amazing they're so soft they've got the prada logo i need to find out if you can purchase this i'm sure you can or like at least one at a time but I just, this to me was everything. I'm forever buying makeup brushes. So thank you so much, Prada Beauty. I had to show you it because I was just so grateful to have it. It was so amazing. And I'll link what I can to see what you can buy. But I've tested it, everything, and it's absolutely amazing. So that is just to conclude the end of my shoot that I did with Tiffany, trying on all their iconic pieces. I'm such a jewelry girl. It was actually Paris that got me into fine jewelry. Because I love my minimal outfits, my knitwear, my jeans and tinner blazer, that's pretty much what, what I always wear. And I just feel that jewellery is definitely something that lasts a lifetime and you can wear the most basic pieces and elevate it with your jewellery, like give it character, pass down forever. I feel like they're really good investments. It's actually a really good time to buy jewellery and diamonds. Um, so they're my favourite pieces. I'm so over the moon with the pearl necklace. I literally love it. I've been waiting for so long. You know I love pearls. 
and it's just the perfect one, the perfect size. This size for me is everything. I'll link the earrings and the bracelet definitely next on my list. Um, but you need to get yourself a bone cuff. They're absolutely exquisite, day and night, statement, fine jewellery. I'm obsessed with it. So I will link them below. Um, thank you so much for watching. Would love it if you would subscribe. Don't forget to follow me on Instagram as well. And I will see you in my next video.